So we decided to go to first watch. Shouts out to Life with Anne C. Because she reminded me that I had a first watch right by where I live at, y'all. Like, right next door. So shout out to Life with Anne C. Go check out her channel. Yeah, we was excited. Actually, I didn't really feel like going anywhere today, but... I said, let's go to First Watch because they close at like 2.30. So they close early, y'all. This is right off of Ritchie Highway in Glen Burnie, Maryland. Look at that sandwich, y'all. I love the decor. Cinnamon toast cereal milk. Not sure what that was, but I think that was a drink, actually. I was in love with the decor. Wow. The hostess was like, she's this taking pictures. I was like, yeah, because I'm going to get out much. So it is you. They were very doing? nice. They were kind of like, where do you want to sit at? Do you want a table? Do you want a booth? And my daughter chose a booth. We got one right in the back, y'all. And I love that. So they had like two different menus there. And one of the menus was two-sided, and I didn't even know it. I was like, oh, my goodness, there's so many choices. I will say this is like a high-end Panera bread. And they had so many different things on there, y'all. And I was like, ah, I don't know. They had, you know, like sandwiches and salads, and they had different types of juices and drinks. And so... The waitress, she offered a coffee when um, she first came over there. So, yeah, I love that. Love my coffee. So, yeah, it took us a little while to figure out what we wanted. My daughter got the orange juice. She was not really a coffee drinker like that. So, yeah, we're going to put our cream in there. So, they only had on... And that little bowl, it was like plain half and half and French vanilla. So I just did the plain half and half. And it had some raw cane sugar there. And you guys, I was so fascinated by doors on the ceiling. Doors on the ceiling. Look at that decor, y'all. I would love to have something like that in a home one day. And look at that. Marilyn Crab portrait, y'all, painting. I thought that was so cool. So they already won me over with the decor and how friendly they were. Now this, I forgot all about y'all. Doesn't that make you think about, you know, COVID and, you know, uh, anyway, I should have asked for plastic utensils. I will bring them next time or ask for them. So that was million dollar bacon and French toast and they had like a berry spread on the side and my daughter she got I forgot what kind of omelet she got, y'all. They had different types of omelets and I'm just posting for the thumbnail picture. But look at that, y'all. The million dollar bacon was like five ninety nine and then the French toast was like ten ninety nine or something like that, y'all. And I would have got some eggs, but I was like, no, I don't think I'm going to get any eggs today. So I'm putting a little bit of the spread on there. And they put, they had butter on one slice, and then on the other slice, they had the powdered sugar. And they were big slices of toast, y'all. So I don't know if this is brioche bread. I'm not sure what type of bread it is. And so I'm trying not to think about the utensils, y'all. I don't know why I didn't ask for the plastic wear. I guess I didn't want to be, want to seem like I was <laughs> being a pest or whatever. But I think I'm going to try to bring them next time because I haven't been out to eat in a long time. Usually I just get stuff to go. And um, so, yeah, I'm trying not to think about the forks and stuff right now so you see i kind of have it hanging on the edge there like i'm trying not to put the whole thing on the fork it was good y'all the food is good really really good
So this mug of coffee was so huge. And I'm not a very fattish drinker, so I said, let me try to drink some of this coffee down, y'all, before I try this million dollar bacon. So, yeah, y'all, look at this bacon. So, it was nice and crispy. I love that. I love that crispy bacon. Um, the slices were generous. So, it's got a kick of heat in it, y'all. You can feel it in the back of your throat. It's spicy, but it's good, y'all. It's like candied bacon, basically, but with a bit of spice to it. And I was trying to figure out. Mm, yeah, they're kicking the spice in the back of the throat there, y'all. But it's good. I say it's more spicy than sweet. So I was showing y'all what I had left. I had a lot left over. So of course we got some boxes. And I was saying, I'm sitting right next to the exit door. I like that. All right. So I'm showing you guys. I'm putting the food in the to-go box. And that's our bag. And this is our check, y'all. Look how much it was. $39.44. And I gave a 20% tip. So 10 out of 10, y'all. I would recommend first watch.